previously on Dragon Quest Builders. The monsters are coming! The monsters are coming! Oh no! You ain't half brave for a bag of bones. I'll never forget your multi. Hey! I'm not gonna die. <laughs> He's making out that I'm going to die. The little swine. I don't know what I was going to do. But now you're here, we can get cracking. <laughs> wow, how quickly he changed. That's so funny. The time to take on the Magmalis, the big boss of the monsters. Before I die. Oh god, look at them all on me. That was so close. That was unbelievably close. Hello uh, and welcome. My name is Miss Multiconsole and welcome back to Dragon Quest Builders. I have quickly found out that there is a very... There's a food shortage. A real bad food shortage. Look at my food up there flashing because my character is really hungry and my health is slowly draining because I have no food and I've looked around and I can't find anything. There is rabbits around here which drop steak but you actually need coal to be able to actually make a food item with it. So here look we can make um unicorn steak. The only piece of food that I know that I can make is egg. If we get a monster egg we can make a fried egg but it only fills your hunger meter by 20% and it's a kind of, it's not a drop that always drops <laughs> if that makes sense. It drops from ghosts and chimeras but it doesn't always drop. Like the chimeras will sometimes drop feathers, sometimes the ghosts will drop nothing so it's not really a good one to <laughs> go for. So there's really a real food shortage. I have built a crude kitchen in the hopes that my fellow villager over here will make me some food but he hasn't made anything as of yet and I have made a bed so that I can rest to get some life back as well. I've collected some healing creams so that we can top our health up whilst we're playing but I'm really hoping that we can find some food items over there whilst we're looking for our villagers and maybe if we get some villagers maybe they will actually build some more food items there's a chance that having more villagers will mean that they will build more items in the crude kitchen I don't know I'm not even sure if they will build it without having resources I don't think they use your resources up but I'm not 100% sure on that either way all I can say is that this is going to be a challenge but the good thing there's one good thing out of this is that I've got nine I think I made nine swords I think I might actually have ten because I already had one so I had a lot of swords from when we collected stone yesterday let me see do these drop anything i want to see if i can get any food around here these prickly peaches yes we can eat the prickly peaches yes <laughs> food items okay let's go and grab these prickly peaches over here and i did see that you could get squid so perhaps we can get a fishing rod later and we could get a supply of food from there this is going to be a challenge this is actually a challenging oh what's that is that a railroad oh cool this is track like, oh, I've seen you can get like little carts. I've seen it on free build mode that you can get little carts and you can like zoom around on the tracks. That's really cool. I wonder if we're going to unlock that today. Oh, God, I'm really close to the ogre. I actually really don't want to get close to that because, yeah, I'm not really that well equipped at the moment. I'm really not. Oh, God, that's better. I've got a bit of a bit of food in my belly now. And my characters must be feeling a lot better, but we do really need to collect some more. This is going to be a challenging chapter. But I'm actually looking forward to having a bit of a challenge because so far I've just flown through the chapters easy peasy. So <laughs> it will be cool to have a little bit of a challenge. So let's see, let's grab some more of this prickly peach stuff. I want to have a, like a little supply just in case so, like we need some. So quick, eat, 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 eat. <laughs> she's going through her food so fast, picking it up and she's eating, oh my god, he's got his tongue sticking out. The ogres look so funny. They did look like that on Dragon Quest Heroes though, so that's not really new for me. I already knew what the ogres look like. I already knew they have silly faces. Okay, so let's go towards this quest objective and I hope that we can do it. I've got plenty of stone swords. So I'm really hoping that we can do this today. That would be awesome. Pick up any prickly peaches on the way. Because that seems to be the only food source that I can easily get at the moment. So keep your eyes open. Ah, I see quite a lot around this area. Which is awesome. Shame there's not any more food supplies. I really want some more. I could make the steak if I had some coal. But I don't know where coal is or anything at the moment. And oh, there's a slime. I killed the slime. Okay, first splat of goo. So I've really not done much yet. 
to be honest with you, I've been too scared to play. Like, just before I recorded, I built those rooms and I was like, oh my god, I don't want to play because, like, I'm dying. <laughs> have I gone the wrong way? I think I might have gone the wrong way. I think I'm going down this way. I think it's somewhere here. Wait, are they in this little house? Is that, is that what it's pointing to? It's pointing to this house. There's some stuff here, though, so I will take this stuff. The sheets of paper are covered in large, untidy handwriting. Morty tries to make out the words. I just destroyed it. Don't know how, but I'm still alive. Tried to limp back to the hideout, but the monsters have blocked off the pass. They've got it guarded, and I don't got the strength to make it over the mountains. I'm going to head back to the mine, hold myself up, and try to come up with a plan. Okay, the note ends there. It looks like it was written quite recently. Okay, so we've got a new quest marker, so it's taking us to a new location. So let's grab that, and we're going to go somewhere else now. So we're going to go... That's, that must be the mountain that he was talking about. There's a mountain up here. So, what are these blocks? What are these blocks? Oh look, there's someone down there, he's saying so hungry. What are these blocks? I've never seen these blocks before. I wonder if we can take these blocks. Crumbly Clodstone. Interesting, I have never seen this type of block before. We got too much stuff. Ah, uh, I, I dropped the, the, the um, basket thing again. Clodstone, what is this? Is this um, clay? Is that clay? I think that's clay down there, so I'm not too bothered about that. Let me just climb up here then and see if we can get to the other side. Oh, I hate having just not been able to pick stuff up again. It's so goddamn annoying. I hate it. Why can't they just let me have the colossal coffer? I just need wood, but there's no trees around here. No trees whatsoever. So I can't actually build the colossal coffer. I need to look around for some wood. We need to find some trees. Oh, hopefully I can find some trees soon. Okay, let's go towards this mark. I'm going the wrong way again. I'm going to go this way, I think. Is it this way? I saw someone say they were so hungry. Are they down? Are they inside the mountain? Perhaps? I don't know. Down there. Yeah, he's inside the mountain. We need to dig down, guys. I think we need to dig down anyway. I'm not entirely sure what else, how else we get to him. Let's see. Dig, 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 dig. Go, multi dig. <laughs> Go, my character. Oh, we found some type of. Oh, is that coal? Okay. I think I might have. Oh, hello. I think I found him. Hello there. Uh, <coughs> who, who are you? I'm a b b burly. <coughs> I can't speak. Throat too, too dry. Please give me a pr. A, pr a prickly peach. No, they're my prickly preaches. <laughs> all right, I'll give you one, but that's all you get. Here you go. Whoa, 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 what are you doing? All right, I'm back in action. I'm scared. So, whoa, what happened? <laughs> Why did the floor break? Oh, there's like crumbly bits in the floor. Oh, man. <laughs> I've got to be careful where I step, okay? Whoa, that's it, the spot. I don't know who you are, mates, or where you've come from, but you've done me a power of good. I came a cropper fighting the monsters. Thought I'd hold myself up here till I got my strength back, then scurry back to the eyed out with my tail between my legs. Problem was, the monsters had built some kind of barricade blocking off the pass. So I came back here and racked my brains, trying to come up with a plan of how I was going to get back to Cole, till my food ran out, that is. So, what's your story then, mates? Are you trying to hide from the monsters and all? <laughs> no, I'm here to rescue you. Are you serious? Glad you must got you to break through the barricade and come here and rescue me. I can't believe it. How could a stick insect like you do all that? Hey, stop being so mean to me. But let's leave the explanations till later, eh? We can have a good old chin wag when we're back in coal. Okay. I think that's just how they talk. They just, they seem to be like a bit forward. They just, I think they're the type of people who just say what's on their minds without thinking about people's feelings. That's what I kind of get the impression. You know, some people are like that. It's not, not a bad thing. It's not always a bad thing. Sometimes it's a bit much. Sometimes it's actually a good thing because they're quite truthful. But yeah, let's <laughs> head back. I wonder if we can use the... We use a chimera wing with this guy. He will come back, right? I think he does. Yes, I think he does. Because I'm a little bit scared of being around this area. I don't really know what to do. <laughs> okay, here he comes. Okay, we're back to the base. Awesome. We got a new villager. We got a second villager now. Let's talk to him. Whee! <laughs> Fwee? <laughs> What's fwee? <laughs> it didn't have feel good to be back in coal. Go and the baths are looking better than ever. Did you do all that? You're something else, you know. We'd never been able to make them look as smart as all that. 
Hold on, you ain't the legendary bodybuilder Barbella was going on about, are ya? Surely not. After all, it ain't like you've got much of a body to write home about. <laughs> You're so rude. <laughs> but anyway, thanks for saving my skin. Oh, and if you need help building up that body of yours, just say the word. We'll make a bodybuilder out of you, yeah. Am I going to come out of this, like, really mustardy? <laughs> you what? Forget the body bit, you're just a builder. <laughs> Don't be so modest, mate. You might be a bag of bones right now, but we'll soon get you into shape. <laughs> okay. I know, I'll train you myself. Ten days with me and you'll have a six pack you can scrub your smalls on. <laughs> I'm a lady, I don't want a six pack. <laughs> Alright, let's talk to this guy here. Let's see, he should be really happy we got his friend back. Alright. Well, butter my buns and call me a crumpet. What? <laughs> This is so weird. I like crumpets though, crumpets are good. Burley's back. We all got split up when the monsters came and smashed up coal. But if we can get the gang back together again, we can take the fight back to the monsters. Soon as the boys are back in action, and we've tracked down where the monsters have taken Barbella, we can bust her out of there. Alright, and if anyone knows where those blighters have taken Barbella and our other mates, Burley will. Oh, so Burley might know where Barbella is. Don't give up, Barbella. I'm coming for ya. He must really love her. I wonder if it's an actual two-sided love or if it's like unrequited love. I wonder if Barbella actually loves Glutamus as well or if he's just in love with her. Interesting, interesting. Or do you think all these guys like her? It'll be interesting to see how this plays out. Who's Barbella? Who ain't she more like? She's the leader of our gang, the woman of our dreams, and the queen of our arts. Oh yeah, it is as well. I reckon they all love her, but she probably doesn't love any of them. She's our mother, our lover, our sister, and our friend. But most of all, she's our one and only Ope. This will be interesting when we get Barbella. But now the monsters have gotten their rotten, dirty mitts on her, we've got to get her back if it's the last thing we do. Mossy, will you do me a favour? When the time comes to break Barbella out of the clink, Will you come with us? Of course. Oh, we're we gonna like have an army of these thugs going to rescue this woman. That'd be funny. Let me tell you something, Malty, just between you and me. All right, all right, what's he saying? Barbella likes a nice salt bath better than anyone. So when we break her out of that cold, stinking prison, she's gonna wanna get clean all over, <laughs> if you know what I mean. This guy is a pervert. <laughs> I'll say no more. <laughs> but if that ain't enough to convince you to help, I don't know what is. That doesn't convince me at all. <laughs> Are you for real, you dirty pervert? <laughs> okay, let me quickly drop these blocks. Chuck them over there so I can get my seed of life. I don't care about that blocker for a second. I can collect that in a second. Oh, look, he just changed. They all look exactly the same. They literally look all exactly the same. Apart from, I think that guy's skin colour is slightly darker than... Is he called Burley's? I don't know. Yeah, Burley. <sighs> So Barbella's not back yet then. I should have never got my opes up. He doesn't speak as common as the other guy. He speaks a little bit common, but not as bad. Last time I saw her, she was being carried off by the monsters and she looked in a bit of a bad way. Wherever the rosters have taken her, we've got to get in there and break her out sharpish. Okay, only thing is, it's gonna take more brawn than we've got to get her out in one piece. That's where you come in, Morty. You know how people say you are what you eat? Well, I was about making me a massive protein-packed meal to bulk me up a bit. How the hell do you expect me to do that? I don't know if I mentioned it, but I'm a vegetarian. Oh, you can't be picky around these parts, I'm telling you that, because there is literally no food here. <laughs> you don't want to know how much grass I've got to eat just to keep myself in shape. <laughs> but I believe in you, Marty. I know you can cook me a meal what'll make my biceps bulge. <laughs> Lovely. When I first met you in the mine, you picked me out the juiciest prickly peach I've ever tasted. I can't wait to see what you can do with the rest of the cactus. Oh, okay. Go on, Multi. Make me a delicious, nutritious cactus dinner, which will put even more muscles on my chest. Okay, let's think about that. What the hell can she make out of cactus? Cactus steak? Wait, wait, wait. How is that possible? How can it be a steak? Steak is meat. What? That makes no sense. A fragrant and filling fillet of flame grilled cactus fills hunger meat by 40%. Well, that's good though, because now we can actually get 
food items out of those cactus plants. So I guess it's good in a way, but it just doesn't make sense. I thought steak was meat. Like, what? <laughs> it's just so weird. But okay. I think I might have to just put dirt walls all the way around because I don't think we actually have enough brick to go around the outside of this base at the moment. So let me just check a second. Let me just see. Hmm, cactus steak. We need coal. I need to find some coal. I think there was some over on the island. Oh no, monsters. This is another thing that happens, is that I keep getting a ton of scorpions come in, and it's not just one. I seen like earlier there was like two or three of them all coming at once. It's crazy. And because I don't have walls, they can literally just come right into the base. But at least we've got some actually he actually helps you fight which is nice he's got a giant hammer this guy he does nothing he is like the most useless villager ever i don't even know why he's here <laughs> you get rid of him and just keep burly <laughs> at least burly does something <laughs> so we're gonna rest because i don't want it to go to night time because it's already challenging enough at the moment it probably is not going to be that hard once we actually start getting some buildings together but at the moment since we barely have anything it's actually quite challenging so what we're going to do now is we're going to see if we can find some coal so we can make some of this weird steak <laughs> i have no idea what is going to be in this well i guess coal and cactus but that's just so weird. How would that even taste good? It's just the worst combination ever. But whatever. Let's go over here and see um, what we can do. I wonder if there's a chest at the top of that cliff. There's normally chests on those cliffs. I might check that out at some point. Let's go over here and see if we can find some coal. I did see, yeah, I think that might be coal just there. And if we can make coal, no, we need we need wood for the colossal coffer, but we might be able to make a furnace if we can actually get coal. Let me see, I wonder if we can find any more. Because this actual stuff here, whatever this is, I can't remember what it was called, whatever it was, it was actually quite tough, this cobblestone block or whatever it is. I've got some ruby already, although we can't make anything out of it. I don't like how we fall through the floor, it's horrid. I keep thinking I'm going to fall like six foot under the bloody floor. <laughs> take that and see if I can get some more of this coal because we're definitely going to need some more probably more than a couple of blocks you see you can't really see what I'm doing but yes okay Ugh, stop and there's a hammer hood here maybe he will drop his little needle so we can get nah so we can get a plushie that would have been cool there's another bit of ruby there but I'm not really bothered about it just want to get a little bit more coal we got like 11 pieces let's just finish this little bit here finish this bit here get this and then we'll return to base let's get this bit and this bit right let's return to base now now that we've got a bit of coal let's go 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 this is actually my last chimera wing as well so i probably should go and collect some more chimera wings otherwise we're gonna be walking everywhere <laughs> so let's see if we can now build some of this cactus steak thingy majig let's see if we can do this cactus steak so strange all right let's talk to burley he's really happy look brilliant work mate oh no cool now that's what i call a steak come on then multi and it over all right here you go enjoy bon appetit mmm that steak smells absolutely gorgeous i can feel my biceps getting bigger already those monsters what kidnaps barbella won't know what hit them <laughs> well that's good why did they kidnap her in the first place uh, I don't know really. After they caught her, they were trying to get her to tell them about something. But Barbella wasn't having any of it. She got a tight lip that one. When she wouldn't talk, the monsters got proper miffed and took her away with them. The goddess only knows what they're trying to get her to say. But anyway, Malty, thanks for the steak. Okay, that's really weird. Once I've got this down me, I'll have all the strength I need to head into the monster's lair and bring back Barbella. What, really? Already? Oh, we got a nice bit of coal for doing that as well. That's awesome. Okay. Oh, we got an invasion coming up next. Let me see if I can actually build some more of this. Oh, yes. So we can build some more of this. That's so nice to see that we can actually build some stuff here. 
Okay, awesome. We got a little bit of food now, so that is really nice. So let me just see quickly. I wonder if we can... Oh, look, we can now make a fishing rod, so I'll be able to get some more food with that too. I wonder if we can make a forge with that. We need copper. I think I did see some copper, so I think I might actually make some... Um, I think I might actually make a forge. I'm going to have a look around off camera and just see if I can make a forge, because I reckon I should be able to make one now. Anyway, guys, I'm going to stop here for today. I hope you enjoyed we are slowly making progress this is an awesome chapter so far and i can't wait to play some more we gotta go and save barbella she is gonna be so funny when she joins we're just gonna have all these men all swooning over this woman it's gonna be absolutely hilarious but okay anyway we're gonna stop here i hope you enjoyed thank you for watching please comment rate and subscribe and i hope i'll see you next time